All right, so you got a bar up here. It doesn't look bad. He kept the cardboard on it while they were working on it, so they didn't do a bunch of stuff. Said the guy's working on it, probably drank some of his rum and whiskey. I don't doubt it. That motor's got a good block that needs the top end redone. Maybe the cams, not sure. Starboard motor has 10 hours on it. They blew the port coming home from the rebuild. So I think $25,000 of work. Here's your V-Birth. The mattresses are here. It has the usual boat smell in here, moist, you know, but it's not horrible, but I wouldn't sleep on it if I had allergies, if I had allergies. I'm sure he's going to get his personal stuff out of here. Um, there's paint loose, but it's not rotten. It's all here. I'm looking here a little bit. Look inside a little bit. Yeah, man, we're clean. Also, where they put some numbers, believe it or not, in these boats. See, I haven't found a rotten spot in this boat anywhere other than some trim work and stuff. Very, very neat little setup. Here goes the crew on the port side, twins with a closet. Shit. It's bolt freaking rotten. Damn, that old closet. And that's going to be your access as well. Nice. Okay. Another closet. Regular fridge up in here mounted with the hasps on it. Uh, the ACs do work, um, but they need to be serviced. He hasn't tried it. He never had a reason to. It's hooked up to shore power now. Starboard motor's good. Fuel needs to be polished. Ceiling needs to be wiped, but it's not falling down. Go to the front and check it. And same thing here. Yeah, we're good. We're good. No, it's Todd. What? Dog. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yes, sir. Oh, there are. Yeah. They're, they're under the deck here. Okay. Right? It's a, a two, uh, a two nibble props. Do you need a motor for that Boss and Whaler tender? Because I got a 20 horse motor for that Boss and Whaler tender if you need one. Four stroke Suzuki. Yeah. 